from WDTN, the station that's working for you. This is 2 News at 11 with breaking news. And we do begin tonight at 11 with the latest on tonight's breaking news out of Dayton. A water rescue effort is underway as crews are reportedly searching for a teen who went into the water and never resurfaced. 2 News reporter Kristen Eskow has been live on the scene. She's near South Gettysburg Avenue with a look. Kristen? Brooke and Mark, we've just received an update from Dayton Police. They tell us they're not 100% sure someone is in the water, but say a family is out here looking for a young adult male. Now, we've seen all evening crews out here with boats, flashlights, using sonar equipment. More recently, we've seen divers in the water, but police say they may have to suspend the search soon for the evening as it's hard to see in the water at night. Now, officials say they were called here around 7 30 this evening. Police say some kids were on the bank of the Pond and told them a young man was in the water having trouble swimming. Police say they told them he was struggling to stay above the surface and was asking for help. That's when someone called 911. Police say a fisherman told them he saw the same thing. Now, we've seen crews out here from the Dayton Fire Department as well as the Box 21 rescue team and Wright Patterson Air Force Base. Neighbors around here tell me they don't often see people going into the water out here. They say sometimes people are out here fishing, but hardly ever swimming in this water. Now, we're Still waiting to find out exactly why and how this young man got into the water. Lakeside Drive remains closed at this hour as this extensive search and rescue effort continues. For now, we're live in Dayton. Kristen Escow, 2 News, working for you.